Hello friends, today in this lesson we will learn how to multiply two digit numbers by one digit numbers. So let's get started. Thirty five times seven. So we will multiply thirty five by seven. So thirty five is two digit number and seven is one digit number. So write the largest number first, which is thirty five, and then write the smaller number below it, which is seven, and it has only one place. So I'll put the seven right over here, below the one's place in thirty five, and then put the multiplication symbol right over here. So you could read this as thirty-five times seven. Now we are ready to multiply. And this one you could call the standard way. So first, I start with seven times five. So seven times five is thirty-five. So I will not write. Thirty-five right over here. I will just write five and carry three in tens place. This three I will carry in tens place. Now I start with three times seven, and three times seven equals twenty-one. I will not write twenty one write down here because we have three here. We can't put twenty one down here because we have to add this three in twenty one. So twenty one plus three equals twenty four. Now we will write twenty four down here. Three was the last number which I had to deal with. When we multiply thirty-five by seven, the product will come as two hundred forty-five. Now let's take another example. Fifty-four times eight. We will write the largest number first. And then write the smaller number below it, which is eight. And I will write eight right over here below the ones place in fifty-four. And then give the multiplication symbol here. Now I will start with eight times four. So eight times four is thirty-two. I will just write here. Two, which is units place, and I'll carry this three in tens place. Now I will start with eight times five. So eight times five is forty. But we can't just put forty right down here because we have to add this three. In that forty, so forty plus three equals forty-three. So we will write here forty-three. Now you see fifty-four times eight is four hundred thirty-two. Let's take next example. Ninety-six. Times nine. So first, I write the largest number, which is ninety-six. Below it, write the smallest number, which is nine, and it has only one place. So I'll put the nine right over here, below the one place in ninety-six, and then give the multiplication symbol. Now let's start to multiply. 
first I will start with 9 times 6. So, 9 times 6 equals 54, but I will not write 54 write down here. I will just write 4 which is in units place and I will carry this 5 in tens place. Now, I start with 9 times 9. So, 9 times 9 equals 81 and we cannot just put 81 right over here because we have to deal with this 5. We have to add this 5 in 81. So, 81 plus 5 equals 86. Now, we can write 86 down here and the multiplication will become 864. So, 96 times 9 equals 864 or 9 times 96 also will be 864. Let us take next example 73 times 4 equals. So, we'll write the largest number first which is 73 and then write the smaller number which is 4 and it has only 1's place. So, I will put that 4 right over here below the 1's place in 73 and then give multiplication symbol. So, now we are ready to multiply. First, I will start with 4 times 3. So, 4 times 3 equals 12. So, this is units place. So, I cannot write 12. So, I will just write 2 here only and I will carry this one in units place. Now, I will start with 4 times 7. So, 4 times 7 equals 28. As you see here, 7 is the last digit. So, we cannot write down say, uh, 28 because we have to deal with this 1. We have to add this 1 in 28. So, 28 plus 1 equals 29. Now, we can write 29. You see 73 times 4 equals 292. Let us take one more example. 49 times 6 equals what? First write largest number which is 49 and then write the smaller number which is 6 and I will put the 6 right over here below the 1's place in 49 and then give multiplication symbol and then we will start multiplication. First, I start with 6 times 9 and 6 times 9 equals 54, but we cannot write 54, the whole number here, we, we will write only 4 in units place and we will carry this 5 in tens place. Now, I will start with 6 times 4 which will come as 24. Now, we have to deal with this 5. We cannot write just 24 right down here. We have to add this 5 in 24. So, 24 plus 5 equals 29. Now, we can write 29 here. So, the multiplication will come as 294 means 49 times 6 equals 294 guys i hope you will like this video so share it and like it and subscribe to my channel thank you